three tips on how to get your first real estate deal with little or to no marketing. That's today's topic. Let's dive right in. This is Mark Perry. I'm the CEO of the Lee Capital Investment Group. And today I want to talk about three tips how you can get involved in real estate with little or to no money in marketing. Now, to, now today, the first one we're going to talk about is bandit signs. Bandit signs has been around for quite some time. What you can do if you live in a, in a big a big city, uh, you want to at least get about two, 250 to 300 bandit signs. You can put them all across where the stop signs are, and you put, you know, we buy houses for cash, we close quickly, or we buy homes, uh, we close quickly, or we close fast. And put your number at the bottom, and this is how individuals will reach out to you and see what you have to offer. That's number one tip. And usually, band of signs might cost a little bit, maybe one fifty to to uh, to two hundred dollars. De depends on how many signs you're getting. So that's one way where you actually can not spend so much on marketing and have sellers calling you. Second tip I want to talk about is cold calling. Cold calling has been around for quite some time. If you if you can get on the phone and um, and be yourself, relax. Uh, and talk to these sellers. Um, just get basic information like you know square footage of the house, uh, what's the bedroom and bathroom. Um, uh, do it need, does it need any rehab? Um, what location is it in, and so forth. So these are the type of things that you can ask the seller. Because what will happen is once you ask all these questions, you'll get down to the needy ingredient to see why they want to sell, and that will determine if they're motivated or if they're not motivated. That's number two tip, and that's free. But that's number two. Number three tip is joint ventures let's say if uh, you don't have a deal right now let's say if you don't want to get on the call with these sellers well one of the things that you actually can do is you actually can go to some real meetings or go to some seminars in your local area and you actually can just build your buyers list like talk to a lot of individuals and see you know what their criteria is write their criteria down see if they're cash buyers see if they're doing financing um, see what areas they want to invest in and you write all this down you get much as buyers as possible and let's say if you have another wholesaler and he happens to have a deal, but he doesn't have his buyers list up, but you have your buyers list up. So what you guys can do is you can joint ventures and put that deal together and split the profits. That profit can be 10,000, that profit can be 15 or even 20. But these are three tips that can get you involved into a real estate deal, your first real estate deal with little or to no marketing money out your pocket. That's today's show. And if you have any questions, um, feel free to comment below. Or if you like my channel, uh, feel free to subscribe to my YouTube channel. And uh, thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys on the other side.